With episode 1 and 2 of Has Been Hotel finally out, they both contain a lot of fun secrets and references in the background that you might have missed on your first viewing. In this video, I'll compile all the things you might have missed. So first up is that the color icons reference the character's previous designs. Velvet has her old hair and clothes, and the Lucifer duck has his old hat design with a purple snake and without the crown. Each character has a unique phone case. Charlie's has an apple, while Angel Dust has spider webs. During the Happy Day in Hell song, Charlie grabs onto a delivery truck called Helva Post, an obvious reference to Helva Boss with its name and logo. If you purchase any merch on Amazon, it'll say it's being delivered via Helva Post as well. In a portrait on the wall, we see a family photo of Charlie with Lucifer and Lilith. Vox and Valentino own the same plants that Stola owns. During Vox's song, he shows a drawing of Alistair. This is the same drawing that Vivzy Pop tweeted in March of 2022. He also has some insecure messages that cycle at the bottom of the screen and has a mug saying F Alistair. When Vox blue screens, it says it's caused because of Alistair.exe. During the scene where Serpentius gets confronted, there's a model of the Hell Rings in the background. A photo in the background shows an old image of Vox and Valentino. Valentino wears a fedora instead of a top hat and has both of his antenna. Vox has a box head with a red and black suit. Kiki does the cat loaf pose during one scene. We see Baxter on a TV monitor. Velvet and Valentino sell an item called the Love Potion. As Moody specifically mentioned in Hell of a Boss that he refuses to make these, which shows how bad Valentino and Velvet are if they're making things the Sin of Lust won't even stoop so low to make. Valentino has his own Fizzerali robot. It has a custom colour scheme, a bit like the robots that Mammon has. And lastly, Angel's voicemail has different visuals for the nice messages and the abusive ones. So that's some of the things I noticed in episode 1 and 2 of Has Been Hotel. If there's anything you think I'd missed, I'd love for you to leave them in the comments section down below. Thanks for watching.